Hi, this is Camille Jasmine with today's Oceans of Opportunity. Today we're going to talk about some local trends in our market. I want to step back by looking four years ago. What we have in the green, which is the higher part, were the new listings back since January of 2009. And as you can see, they always pretty much outweigh the blue, which are the sales over that same period of time. So I want to point out a few um, things here. First of all, you can see we have seasonal trends year after year, even though we were in a shifting market. We had lots more inventory in 09, 10, and 11, and then started going down. And then what we did see more of were more sales over that time. So that's kind of the big picture over the last four years. And then moving on, just since July of last year, and I'm looking at South Bay and Palos Verdes, by the way, kind of went to a smooth line to uh, make it a little clearer. And we noticed back in November of 2012, we had a shift where we actually had more sales, where my little arrow is, than new inventory coming on the market. And that's when we had the beginning of that drying out of the excess inventory. So you've been hearing that we've had very low inventory and that's part of the reason. Because we're actually seeing more listings come on the market throughout the year, but actually also an increase of sales. And so now we're seeing kind of a pacing of the two as we go into the summer months. Now in terms of sales price increases, overall we've been hearing about a 25% increase. Now these are median prices and it can change uh, depending on where you are. But basically back in uh, August of 2012, we're about at 410. And here in June of 13, we're at 575. That's a $165,000 difference or 40% increase. Ouch, for those buyers that have had to uh, have that and yippee for the sellers. Then moving on, uh, basically, specifically in Palos Verdes, this is why I wanna show you how it can change you know, we were at 810 back in uh, 2012 and at about 1.3 on median income or median sales. That's a $490,000 change. And then lastly, I want to talk about interest rates because what we're seeing more recently is a half percent increase in interest rates. And we're probably going to continue to see more of that to come and going up as we get into 2014. And that may definitely stabilize our prices and our inventory over that time. So we don't see any great changes in the next few months, but there's always some volatility, and I think we might be shifting to a little bit more equal market moving forward, not such a crazy seller's market. And that's today's Oceans of Opportunity. Have a great day.